Hey folks, man, this is Monk, and we're back with another episode of Monk's Box, your unboxing video series where we unbox tech toys and sneakers. Subscribe to the channel and um, hit that uh, notification button too, so you know you'll be aware of what we dropping and what we putting out over here. And um, once again, man, you never you know, never what, know you're what you're gonna, gonna get. get. And this is a special one for me, man. I'm really hyped for this release. This is something I wanted since they were first announced and we saw pictures of them. But this is the Spider-Man um, origin story, Air Jordan 1, man. And uh, let's take a look at this because, um, boom. Like, these are crazy right here. So we're going to put this one to the side. Um, this is a, definitely a Jordan 1, but it's got some extras going on with it. So, booyah. <laughs> but we'll get into these uh, extras and details, you know what I'm saying? We're going to sit one to the side. Um, as you notice, um, you know, they come with uh, two sets of laces. So on this pair, we've got the red laces with blue tips. On this pair, we've got black laces with red tips, which more matches the, um, you know, the swish and the other accents. This one um, probably is going to more match the, uh, the tongue right here. Um, but let's get into this a little bit, man. You know, we got, you know, you've seen Jordan ones before. You kind of know what to expect. You know, design is pretty much the same. So really at this point, they're more experimenting with color schemes and materials. So first thing that stands out on this, um, are these dots, these reflective dots all over the shoe. And these are going to kind of mimic, you know, comic book, um, you know, the old school comic books, you know, the way they would do the printing in them. Um, and as well as, um, you know, Spider-Man suit, you know, from the film. Um, one thing that I do want to point out right here, though, is um, you got to kind of get in really, really super close. But the, the trim in these black areas on the shoe, as well as the swoosh, there's a really uh, fine um, honeycomb pattern going in. I'm not sure if the camera's going to pick that up, you know, when you get in close on them. And that extends into this um, little peekaboo area in the midsole, as well as the um, the switch down here, too. You know what I'm saying? You get that thing uh, replicating. It's kind of like a really, really, really fine honeycomb pattern. And I think that's a really a nice touch, a nice detail. Um, the other big standout feature on these is going to be this icy blue sole at the bottom i love the icy blue soles they don't stay this way but for me it'll definitely get me to look at your shoe and buy it <laughs> you know what i'm saying and pick it up i love that detail um so these were worn by uh, miles morales in the um spider-verse film uh, which for me it might be the best spider-man film available it's either going to be that or one of the uh, tom holland Far from home, uh, home alone. <laughs> you know, one of them type films. But, but I love this shoe, man. This thing is amazing. Um, um, yeah, the other accent right here, you know, as I pointed out before, um, we've got the uh, the Nike Air on the uh, tongue, which is you know blue and red. Um, what else we got going on here? Um, the sole in the bottom too. We also get a uh, Nike Air on the uh, inside right here. Sure, if the camera's picking that up, but I do want to point out though, um, there were a few people. I think the friends and family version of these came with a, a more specialized box that actually had you know Spider Man, you know, design kind of looked like his costume, like the chest area, you know, draped over, you know, printed on the box. But, um, yeah, other than that, you know, the other pairs uh, that went out to more mass <laughs> production, they came in a box like this, you know, a regular you know jordan one uh box that we typically see with these releases but um these things are beauties like uh, this is amazing man like <laughs> it's kind of crazy that i feel like part of my motivation for living sometimes is just to get stuff like this and, and i can't resist it man like uh, it might be a problem yo <laughs> but these are tough man this is going to be the um air jordan one uh, origin story edition man you know what i'm saying and i'm up, and i'm gonna be out man make sure you subscribe to the channel because we got more flavors and more kicks and more stuff on the way coming at you uh on monk's box you know what i'm saying and i want to give a shout out to a couple of people shout out to blur con i attended this weekend it's kind of ironic that this is the shoe that i do after blur con which was a um um blurred centered um convention held in dc it's an annual event um this is the first time they've held it since COVID. i think it got canceled last year so despite that it still had a nice turnout you know what i'm saying the people showed up i actually saw a couple pairs of these there at the convention man so the people came through representing 
you know what I'm saying, rocking the Miles Morales. Um, you know what I'm saying? And shout out to Sneaker Tweakers, man, too, man. It's a dope ass group. Shout out to your average sneakers guy. Shout out to Can I Kick It? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And shout out to Concentrated Podcast, man. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. But Monk is out, man. I'm going to catch you folks next time. Peace. <laughs>